Just shut up, Red Fang. This is not a beast ship. I need some time to take care of things. You willingly donned the skin of a lowly beast to join this mission, dedicating yourself to our glorious cause. And now you're telling me you can't handle it? Do you realize how many ships we need? I'm doing my best, all right? It takes time to figure all this out. When the guns go off tomorrow, all eyes will be on it. That'll be our only chance. How's that? Who's there? Who are you guys? An impromptu inspection. Why are there outsiders loitering in Stargazer Navalia? And uh, a bunch of kids at that. <laughs> Hey, kids, didn't your parents ever tell you to stay away from the Stargazer Navalia? I know it's an automated facility, but it doesn't mean you can just break in and do what you want. First of all, I'm an adult. Second, I didn't just break in. Yeah, we flew here on a star skiff. Like, whoosh! <laughs> well, I'm not trying to tell you off, but this place is off-limits to the public, you know? Uh, big sis! Let's go! I... I want to play in Everhunt Plains! Huh? Everhunt Plains? Uh... Uh, yeah, sure. A big sis will take you there. Shuha! You should have let me. Shh, the overhaul is done, and everything looks good. We should leave. Just said, Yenching. What did I say? Big sis, let's go. I want to play in everyone planes. Uh, come on, can't you read the room? Something is definitely off about the three people we just met. Yeah, anyone could see that. <laughs> I just wanted to hear you say it again. That pink haired fox tried to say something. I'm pretty sure he sent something fishy. Since he's not familiar with this place, he just dropped us a hint. But you didn't seem to be paying attention at all. I knew that from the beginning. They said they were doing an overhaul, but it looked like they had no idea how to operate the Starskiff production line, right? And... It's suspicious how they suddenly finished their overhaul and walked away as soon as they laid eyes on us. A clout knight, a member from the Skyfaring Commission, and a craftsman. They're from various departments, and the reason for the overhaul seems legit. But one of them blurted out some weird language just now. Did you hear that? <sighs> I have a feeling that if we secretly tail them, we'll definitely catch these guys in the act. Follow my lead, and be careful not to blow our cover. Never mind who they are. Let's just film them. We should have just killed those lowly beasts. Those little brats won't take up much space. There are boxes all over this place. Just dump them into one and no one will notice. 
cut the theatrics, Grulok. Even the slightest slip-up could interfere with Lord Moktok's plans. So where are we heading next? To check the freight skiffs. We've got a lot of preparations to do. Also, don't forget to take those crates with you. Weapons, supplies. We've got to be well prepared. Otherwise, we're screwed. So... are they... smugglers? What exactly are they up to? I have no clue, but they seem to be moving those crates. I've got an idea. We can hide inside the crates and follow them. in here. I can hardly breathe. Just hang in there. Let's just put the cargo here for now, all right? Then we'll move on to inspect the ships. Lord Moktok said that as soon as we're done, we're to board the freight skiff and leave this place. Don't worry, I've changed the shipping schedule. You two, come with me. Is it just me? I keep smelling that stench of lowly beasts everywhere we go. Don't be so paranoid. Looks like they're planning to escape on the skiffs in Stargazer Navalia. They keep talking about their plans, but where do they come from? And what do they want to do on the Sienjo? Oh, they're definitely up to something bad. Wait, uh, they disappeared! Uh, let's catch up to them! Tread softly. Breathe quietly and make sure to keep an eye on them. Hide out of sight as soon as there's any sign of activity. out of time! Get over here! Zuhart! I'm coming! They're leaving! We should catch up to them! Quickly! wearing official uniforms, but I'm pretty sure they're not members of the Skyfaring Commission, the Artisanship Commission, or the Cloud Knights. <sighs> this is way too suspicious. Uh, never mind who they are. Let's just film them. That way, if they do anything bad, we'll have solid evidence against them. Look at this. A freight star skiff with enough room to fit at least 20 of my men. I'll let the others know and have them prepare more star skiffs. Once we're past the checkpoint, there will be beast ships waiting for us. Lord Moktok is ready. The revival of our ancient bloodline all hinges on this operation. 
What did he just say? Beast ships? <laughs> Who's there? It's those brats! I told you to get rid of them, but you didn't listen, you idiot! Wipe them all out! Forison? Adusa! Die, you lowly beasts! Here you go, Master! <laughs> Remember to aim for the heart. Bring it on! Time's up! Protect me! Protect me! Fiends or devils! I'll crush them all! Huh. How familiar! You're not very sportsmanlike! Azure Dragon, White Tiger, Less Card! Watch this! Let's duel! There's your reward! Those with the loaded gun, those who dig their own grave. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. How is this possible? How did these Foxians change their appearances like that? They're not Foxians at all. They revealed their true form. They're Borison, just like the bandits I defeated on the IPC ship. Wait, that means... Well, how did the Borison manage to infiltrate the Sienjo? It's not just a simple disguise of wearing our clothing and shaving their whiskers. They're somehow able to alter their appearance to be indistinguishable from Foxians. They even have official IDs for the Skyfaring Commission, the Artisanship Commission, and... and... even the Cloud Knights? Let me check this fake Cloud Knights tag. Maybe it'll give us some clues. Lujun, an officer of the Patrol Defense Squad? Ah! Uh, wait! What's the matter? I encountered a patrol officer named Lu Jun before. It was a few weeks ago, when we were transporting the Borison prisoners. <sighs> if they can forge official identities and move around the Sienjo without raising suspicion... Oh no. This is bad. Uh, even worse. If you find one cockroach on the Express, it usually means... There are more Boris in hiding on the Sienjo. I bet their plan is much bigger than just stealing information. We've got to report this to the Seed of Divine Foresight. <laughs> <laughs>